How's it going? Welcome to another episode of Back Bay Scale Customs. I'm Little Joe, the Band Knuckle Deep, and we're going to get this going. Hey, how's it going, everybody? Little Joe again. Uh, quick little update video. Uh, as you can see, I got a little sun today. I played outside on Keesler Air Force Base in Biloxi here. Uh, President Obama uh, apparently gave the, a bunch of airmen there a big award saying it's the best base in the country or something, and uh, we got hired to play it. So that was really cool. Uh, I didn't see President Obama. I don't think he was even there. But if he was, they wouldn't let me get that close to him, you know. But all right, guys, here's a quick little update. And first, here's some little projects that I'm working on. And I found a real cool model kit that I bought way back in 2009 or 2010. And I guess it's a cool model kit, but check this out. Um, this thing is just sitting in the back of my closet. Had to blow the dust off of it. And... Uh, you know, it's it's kind of got cheesy box art, but um, it's actually a really cool kit. You can do it as a hard top, or uh, or as a convertible, or as a custom, or as a glass bubble top. And uh, I don't know what I'm gonna do with it. I really don't. I might turn it into Elvira's car. But uh, and of course, here's the body for the Thunderbird with the Allison aircraft engine in it. Uh, that's gonna be real cool. This is an AMT kit. Uh, no, it's actually a Model King kit, but I think it's owned by AMT. So the, they're very similar, you know, simplified in certain areas. But the uh, Allison aircraft engine is just flat out bitching. I mean, it's pretty cool. And, you know, of course, you got the 64 and pallet that I'm fixing to hack up. And then I've got the uh, uh, 70 Chevelle, the, the same one that Rick Arter's building for... Uh, is tribute build. I'm not sure if I'm going to build this or not. I might just r rummage a bunch of parts out of it and uh, uh, just use the body to practice uh, certain things with. But okay, here's some more parts uh, that I've done a little bit of fine detailing to, and I hadn't really done much, but you know, just just enough little details here and there to uh, to warrant. Uh, to warrant some stuff and here is the chassis with the frame some of the exhaust and the gas tank let's see here if I can get it for you oh and this thing does have a uh, posable front end which is really cool and uh, here's the other side And the rims. But uh, I do have a question for you guys. Uh, um, oh, I found this really cool paint. I don't know what I'm going to do with it yet. I might even paint a guitar with it. But this is really cool. Have any of you ever used this before? And if you have, is it worth using? You know? Uh, I got a question for you guys. I ordered some Pegasus wire wheels with uh, the. the uh, stripe the, the white wall uh, and that's what I wanted to put on the 57 because you know they look really cool like that so you guys let me know if if y'all like these or if, or if the wire wheels is what's really going to set that thing off ultimately I'm going to do what I'm going to do but your, your opinion value is valued to me so uh, all right that's about it for now I'm certainly glad y'all are continuing to watch my videos I am tired, so I'm going to go inside and uh, fall down. I've been up since very early this morning lugging equipment around, but I had a very fun day, got paid very well, uh, and met a lot of really cool Special Forces people, and I tell you what, man, I went to go eat because uh, all the food was uh, you know, furnished and everything, so I go in there to eat. And uh, I'll walk through this door, and there's all these special forces pussy. There's all these special forces people uh, running in the background, or, or all around. I come through there with my my long goatee and all my jewelry on, and my long hair, and they immediately come walking up to me and say, "Can we help you? Do you have a pass?" Which I thought was pretty funny. Then, then uh, somebody recognized me, and before it was over, I was signing autographs. So it was kind of cool. But uh, 
Alright guys, I'm Little Joe from Back Bay Scale Customs and the band Knuckle Deep. If you want to see pictures of the gig I played today, you can go on Facebook. I saved them to my page. Uh, the link is down below. So, alright guys, I'm going inside. So, uh, we'll see y'all later.